Hello everyone, welcome to our channel Aditya Rev Interpolity. Today here we are going to discuss about the HP bias decryption. Okay, how to make a fresh HP bias. So what here we are going to do is we have a compact CQ57 over here with an example we are taking over here, which is a 4 MB bias. Now what you are going to do is this exe file we have downloaded from the HP website from the model number of the laptop and you can also use a serial number so what we are going to do is we are going to just uh, use the winrar to extract the file over here you can see after extraction you get the fd files over here this is the three fd files which we have got one two and three now what we are going to do is just we are going to copy this hd file and uh, <coughs> we are going to going to open it on the hex editor and see whether it's in a decrypted mode or encrypted mode you can see the files are in encrypted mode we can't understand what is to be done over here so we are going to close this file after closing this file we are going to copy this file and we are going to a tool or we are going to open and go to this particular tool this tool is been created with the help of one of my friend he made the tool for us and thanks to him for creating such kind of tool now this tool will help us in the decryption of this particular files so what we are going to do ha what we have to do with this particular tool is we have to just drag this tool to this drag encrypt file here and just we have to press on the run button after we do we get a new file so we are going to do this particular things to this similar to files also Okay, we have to do one by one we cannot go all together so one by one we have to do this after doing this now you can see every file has a parallel file to each other after its drag and drop situation that means we will see whether we get a decrypted file or encrypted file so here <coughs> you can see it is a 72.fd now here it is 70.fd.win this was the old file and this is the new file you can see this is in the format where we can understand something what is written over here and this is in a decrypted format okay similarly applies to rest two of the files now we have to use the old file that is our uh, old backup file to compare our bias so for that we are going to drag it to the hex editor now what we are going to do is you can see over here we will take uh, we will see which file is matching to our bias so we are seeing i think so this is really matching to 72 number so we are taking this 72 file as our reference file and we are going to close all the file over here so basically uh, now after the decryption from the encryption of this file we have now what we are going to do is we have to just check it out this is our new file this is our old file and you can see this is a 4 mb file but a new file is of this is our new file and this is of 4224 kb that is 4.12 mb so we have to remove some of the data and we have to match the data to make it complete 4 mb so with the help of old file we are going to copy some header part of it and we are going to just paste it over here uh, to the hex and you can see it is uh, near to matching file now what we are going to do is we are just going to copy and delete this data because this is a pc file data now we are deleting this data over here and uh, we are opening a new file now what we are going to do is we are just going to save this file as a ec dot bin this will be 128 kb file and uh, this is our main bias now you can see the header of the main bias of both are matching over here you can see now we are going to move to the footer part and let's see whether it's matching or not you can see the footer part of both the bias is also matching now and this both are of 4 MB, exactly 4 MB you can see. You can just compare both. 
and just check it out it's matching it's matching exactly so no problem what we are going to do is we are going to do save as and uh, now this is our main dot bin file so we are saving it and this is all done so this is how you can create your own files file and uh, you can use it for flashing on the laptop this is your ec file 128 kb and the main 4096 kb that is 4 mb exact 4 mb file previously you can see it was 4224 kb now it is a 4 mb and 128 kb so thanks for watching our channel i will play event hope you like our channel hit the subscribe button like share and comment and if you want to join or if you are interested in joining our modding classes of bias you can just contact us via given number feel free to contact us regarding the classes of modding thanks for watching our channel i will play event